What's up guys, it's Manson96 here, and today we're gonna play some Portal 2! Yeah, 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 This is an awesome game, I haven't played so much, but I had I have finished Portal 1 on uh, the Xbox 360, and I really enjoyed it, but I sucked at it, because, you know, I suck. But, that's not important, but we're gonna play this, and we're gonna try to be good. And... My computer just froze a bit. Woo! Oh man, the frames are going low. Yeah, I don't have a good computer, so I understand why it's like, oh my god. I only hope it will do good now when we play. Good morning. You have been in suspension for 15 days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Good. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. There is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. This is art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. You should now feel mentally reinvigorated. If you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. Good. Now please return to your bed. Well, that started out well. Or as well. Good morning. You have been in suspension for... Nine, 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 nine. Hello? Anyone in there? Hello? Weekly. Ah, oh, oh, God. You look te um, good. Looking good, actually. Are you okay? How are you? Don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it. Slow. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm. Stay, stay calm. Prepare. It's all the same. Prepare. It's all fine. All right? Don't move. I'm going to get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice, up to you. Okay, um... Uh, let's see what happened. And our... You're right, room there. is crashing. Can you hear me? Hello? Look at the art. So pretty. So pretty. Oh, you're back. Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. But don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although if you do, you do feel alarmed, <laughs> try to hold on to that feeling, because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying at all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me, just say yes. Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you, just, you just jumped, but never mind. Say apple. Apple. Okay, you know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. <laughs> okay, so apparently I'm brain dead. Are now non-functional. Please prepare for reactor core meltdown. Reactor core meltdown. No. Okay, look, I wasn't going to mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. Uh, what are you doing down there? You still Ow! I got the roof the in me. Power ran out, so of course the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Ow! Hold on. Ow! This is a bit tricky. And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell Whoop. me anything? Ow. Why should I be kept informed? You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. Yeah, you shouldn't be. No. Right, close. Can you see? Am I going to make it through? But I love space. Uh, just, just got to get through here. Okay, I just got to <laughs> concentrate. And whose fault do you think it's going to be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? Oh, Me. I hear that one. I hear that one. Okay, uh, this guy shouldn't be driving. Okay, listen, we should get our story straight, all right? If anyone asks, and no one's going to ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive, <laughs> all right? Not dead. Okay. Yeah, I will say that. 
On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. Oh, oh no, no, no. Ow, ow, ow. Good news. I think I broke that my leg. Not a docking station. I think I broke so my leg. Uh, I'm going to attempt a manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Hold oh, on. Oh, fuck. Ow. I think I broke Almost. my jar. Remember, no, I didn't. Because I'm a baby. A makes holes, not bullet holes. Oh, no, I forgot to Don't take time, but it doesn't out. matter. Seriously, do hold on this time. Ow. Oh, we're free. Eh, do you want me to? There we go. To go? Now, I'll be honest, you are probably in no fit state to run this particular type of cognitive gauntlet. But, um, at least you're a good jumper. So, you got that, you got the jumping on your side. Um, just do your best, and I'll meet you up ahead. Okay. Bye! That's the spirit! Ow! Oh. Hello! And again, welcome to the Aperture Science Enrichment Center. Oh, look. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance beyond our control. <laughs> However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. The portal will open, and emergency testing will begin in three... Two, one. Nice. Oh, look at me. Look at that ass. Look at that ass. Look at that ass. That ass. That ass. Yeah, anyway, uh, let's move on. Uh, I don't. I am not recording time or you know keeping track of time, so I will just play. Even in a dire emergency. If cube and button based testing caused this emergency, don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that was what I was gonna say is you know, I'll just play a little and then end it. Anyway, I think Portal is a fun series. I would want to see Portal 3, but I don't think it's gonna happen, but, if you, you know. If you liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. Um, yeah, and then, oh, we have it there. We're just gonna go grab this little cube, turn around, and walk right through. And how the fuck are we gonna get in there? Ah. Uh, no? How do I throw it? Ah! Okay, I think we should be able to get through that, but okay, we will not do that. Ah, just that easy. Okay. But yeah, anyway, we might get in some trouble in the later stages because I am smart, but I'm not portal smart. So, we will hopefully not have too much of a problem, but we will have a problem, I'm pretty sure. Good. I'm brain, because brain dead at some stages. We are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will revive you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. <laughs> Okay, so we're pretty much what I think we are pretty much the only survivors and we society has crashed. The it's the walking dead outside by a manner of animal king, sending a cloud or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable of listening to us. <laughs> okay, let's move on. Wonder if we ever see Wheat hey, again. Oh. It. Hello, Wheatley. There should be a, a portal bag. device on that podium over there. Yes. Oh, oh fuck. Oh, lucky me, there was like two inches of water. Can you see the portal gun? Uh, yeah, I can't see it. So, are you alive? If that's important, you should have asked that first. I'm, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to work nice. on the assumption that you're still alive, and I'm just going to wake you up ahead. I'll wait, I'll wait one hour, then I'll come back, and 
assuming I can locate your dead body, I'll bury you. All right, brilliant. Go team. See you in an hour, hopefully. If you're not dead. <laughs> wow, he's so optimistic about it. Wow, I love this game. Portal 1 I remember I had a lot of difficulties with in some stages, but that was a while ago I played it, so hopefully I'm being getting some smarter. Some testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robots to share. There we go. If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. Okay, let's move on. Uh, let's let's try to make one or two more rooms, and then I'll end the episode. Since I have no track of time. But I got this game on the Steam sale actually. This next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death. Smooth jazz will be deployed in three, two, one. That's how you do efficient work. But yeah, I was going to say that I have uh, some new games because of this Steam sale. So this is one of them, I have Borderlands, ok you got there, let's jump in. But yeah I have some games that we can play. Ok we got the other one up there, oh we need to get there again. Uh, but yeah, it hasn't been so hard yet. Because this message is pre-recorded, any observations related to your performance are speculation on our part. Please uh, disregard any undeserved compliments. Well, <laughs> this looks complete, I think. Let's go up here. Okay, this was nothing. Any reason? Where's the cake, motherfucker? Okay, no cake, no cake, I'm sorry. No cake. The cake is a lie. Oh, here's the door. That's okay, let's do one more after this. And then I end it. What the fuck are you doing, assholes? But yeah, I think... I think this is one of the best games. I think this shouldn't be considered a game. This should more be considered a... Uh, brain trainer. At least I thought Portal 1 was so. Maybe Portal 2 is more fun, I don't know. If the is being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or other objects from space, please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate part of the test. Yeah, if that were to be, we would be f I would be fucked. Ow. Okay, so here's a new place. Okay, so you drop a cube over there. That means we need to get like so. So we can get the cube and put it right there. And then we need to go up there. Uh, I'm just gonna go up and check. Okay, so we need another cube here. Let's just see what's happened. And what do you do? <laughs> ah! I see, I see. Press this. There we go. What a kick! Go on, son! Okay, that's just a plate. Calm down. Uh, let's drop this here and move on. 
The Enrichment Center reminds you that although circumstances may appear bleak, you are not alone. All Aperture Science personality personality constructs will remain function function in apocalyptic low power environments of as few as 1.1 volts. Okay, uh, I'm gonna end it here. And uh, as usual, I want you to like, favorite, and subscribe if you haven't. And uh, bye bye!